Well, welcome back, everybody. I'm glad you guys are joining me today. And uh, this news that's coming out today, the hardest hit individuals are from this is probably Nancy Pelosi and the rest of the corrupt Congress and the and the currently the uh, resident in the White House has probably heard of all of this. And they are working all, all working to ensure they protect their uh, their friends south of the border, the cartel leaders. That's right. President Trump has come up with a plan to eliminate the cartel leaders in Mexico uh, by utilizing the military in covert operations to take these people out, to break up the stranglehold they have on the country of Mexico, possibly even liberating the people of Mexico, and, of course, stemming the flow of drugs coming in through the southern border, and, of course, the people being uh, sent to the southern border with the aid of the drug cartels. President Trump is a president for Americans. Uh, he is looking out for the best interests of Americans. And the best interests of Americans would be able to see the cartels eliminated in Mexico, and which would actually bring more peace to the region, especially in Mexico, uh, if they would welcome it, which I'm sure they would have not have a problem with it. Um, but even if they did, I think it's in our best interest as this uh, sovereign nation to eliminate any threats that's near us, especially in the Western Hemisphere. We need to take aggressive action, and President Trump promises to do so. So before we dive into today's video, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe button if you're new here. Thanks for joining me. Allow me to share some info with you. Hopefully, you can share it with your friends and family. Smash that like button to 1,500 likes. If you like the content, you like the video, you like the channel, check out some of these other videos on the channel by following the, the link right there. Let's go ahead and take a look at what we have here coming to us from uh, the Gateway Pundit. And, of course, this uh, makes me want to vote for Trump even more. This quit trying to convince me to vote for him. I'm already voting for him. This is just like sugar on top, right? It says, uh, Trump planning to send a covert squads to Mexico to take out cartel leaders. This is amazing, right? Trump is reportedly planning to send covert squads into Mexico as soon as he takes office in order to take out Mexican drug cartel leaders wrecking havoc on America. According to a report from Rolling Stone, Trump is mulling the idea if he returns to the White House next year as a part of an effort to uh, strike fear into the hearts of Mexico's most notorious drug lords. The pres uh, former president has not presented specific details in public about these plans. For example, how many U.S. troops he will be willing to send into a sovereign Mexican territory, but the three sources tell Rolling Stone in conversations with close MAGA allies, including at least one Republican lawmaker, Trump has privately endorsed the idea of covertly deploying, with or without Mexican government's consent, special op units that would be tasked, among other missions, assassinating the leaders of top enforcers of the Mexico's powerful and most notorious drug cartels. In some of these discussions, Trump has insisted that the Mex uh, U.S. military has tougher killers than they do, and pondered why these assassination, assassination missions haven't been done before, arguing that eliminating the heads of cartels would go a long way toward uh, hobbling or uh, hobbling, the, yeah, hobbling their operations and striking fear into the hearts of the kingpins. During some of these conversations, Trump has likened these proposals to the 2019 military raid that ordered the result of death of the ISIS uh, leader uh, Abu. Barkar al-Baghdadi, insisting that the U.S. could uh, should approach drug cartel leadership in the same manner. One source uh, who discussed the issue with Trump earlier this year recalls the ex-president saying the U.S. government should have a kill list of drug lords, as this source describes Trump's ideas, and the most powerful and infamous cartel figures that America's special forces would be assigned to capture or take out in potential second term of Trump. Yeah. I'm all for this. Who would not be for this? Who would not be for taking out dangerous cartel leaders in our close ally of Mexico? Why would we not want to help our friends in Mexico deal with an issue they've had to deal with for decades and decades as they have uh, taken uh, basically over the entire country of Mexico? This would be a no-brainer. This is no different than us tackling al-Qaeda and other terrorist organizations. This is what needs to be done. And I, President Trump has my full backing with this plan. This is something I can personally get behind and say, yes, I am all for ridding the drug cartels out of Mexico. Anyway, 
Let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. Of course, you guys can follow me on all my social media, all linked in the description down below. Don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button. And until next time, I'll see you guys later. Have a great, great day.